Hi everyone, just a quick video to show you how easy it is to use the USM100 by Waygate. As you can see, the unit is just turning on now. I have a block all ready to go. I have my MBW70 probe, and then I have a MB4 probe. Just two probes, one for thickness and one for, say, well inspection. So you can see here, the unit is set with various different apps. You can change the images in all the apps. I just have them with words as it's easier for me to distinguish. So for example, we're going first into weld, so weld inspection. We tap in the app. So basically once all the configurations are set up in the app, it's just a case of going to resume. And you will start off from the last point of, uh, of the use of the unit. So you can see here, we've already made our TCG curve previously. I'll show you that in a different video later, how to make that. Very simple again. You have your probe, I have my, uh, my block here. What you're seeing here in the blue line is your envelope feature. So your envelope feature basically tracks the highest point of your, of your probe. And that's just a quick and simple way of just showing how to set it up. Then we want to move on to a different application. We're doing thickness inspection, for example. We go back, we tap in a different app. No requirements here. Remove one probe, tap and resume. Attach the next probe. So we're in the setup page here. I've already set up this app for my uh, my unit. So I'm going straight to data recorder. And now we're in a section here to start recording thickness readings. So it's as simple as attach the probe down. We're just going off the first echo, hit record. Your point is recorded on the right hand side. Same again, let's go to one of these points here. Hit record. It's, it's recorded over here in this section. This section is like a, an Excel page for all intents and purposes. So it has letters across the top, numbers across the bottom, record as many data points as you want. We can then go down and we have the option of exporting to report, exporting CSV. I can go through that in more detail in a different video, but I just want to show you the few quick and easy ways of using the USM 100.